when I heard about the Gwen Stefani what did you romance, think? I'll have to say, I mean, look, I'm happy that they're happy. I'm 90% happy that they're happy. So Hoda may be 10% heartbroken over the love life of her super crush Blake, but the unfiltered Kathy Lee knows just what to say. 50% of these things don't last. So th then you you know you put in the fact he's on the tour, he's on tour, he's, she's got he's got kids, he has no kids. We love them both, but suck. So there's still hope for me? <laughs> yes, there's still hope for Hoda. <laughs> hey, don't speak. So no Blake in Hoda's Christmas stocking, but there is this. So. I did get you something this year you're going to love. Oh, I want one of those. What are those hoverboard hover, things hoverboards. that burn up? <laughs> yes, because she's, she's not hot enough. She needs a hoverboard. <laughs> The holiday is bittersweet for Kathy Lee. It's her first without husband Frank, who died suddenly in August. I am just great. Thank you so much. Thank you. God Thanks bless you guys. all. She and Hoda spending New Year's Eve flashing back to the show's most memorable with a toast to 2015. We are turning up the volume, so our special is going to air right here on NBC. One of them was um, the Gladiator, Russell Crowe. Yeah. Yeah. He showed up. I was afraid of him before he got there. Sweetest guy. So much fun. Amy Schumer. Shut up. <laughs> you are so fun. It's not over, is it? It's, yeah, it's kind of over. What? I mean, there are shocking <laughs> moments of 2015. Whitney Cummings. Yeah. Whitney Cummings flashed her <laughs> Yes, she it was did. It scary. You want to talk about my flexibility? <laughs> I'm trying to erase that from not my Not me, opinion. I liked it. Yeah, of course you did. <laughs>